In the South Bay, a holiday tradition turned into a community event, and it is all to help hundreds of families working this holiday season. ABC 7 News reporter Lauren Martinez is there. This is a tamale making party. Nearly 100 volunteers rolled up their sleeves on Monday in San Jose to make 2,400 tamales. It was a labor of love by the nonprofit Farmworker Caravan. On Wednesday, the organization will deliver these tamales to 200 farmworker families. So everybody's family here today, and we're making tamales with love to deliver to these people who work for us 365 days of the year delivering food to our tables. So today we want to deliver food to their tables. Hundreds of hands helped prepare the filling, the masa, folding, and eventually steaming. There was even a tamale making 101 class. The Mexican dish is a tradition in many Latino households around Christmas time, mine included. Aside from the assembly of tamales, small business owners held a Christmas market. Sandra Martinez Andreas started Garcia E Market by making bracelets first and then added items made by her grandmother in Mexico. She makes this napkin cloth. She actually hand stitches them. And so I thought it would be, you know, really great to also uh, make her part of all this. Um, I feel like all the creativity came from her. <laughs> Claudia Lopez sells handcrafted jewelry and home goods from Guatemala and Mexico. Her boutique is in San Juan Bautista. I really want to show everyone, share the culture and really show that we have beautiful handcrafted items. For me, it's just a great opportunity to be here to market myself, my business, support and give back to the community that way. By Monday evening, volunteers were still cooking and packaging the tamales that will be gifted to farm worker families in Half Moon Bay. In the South Bay, Lauren Martinez, ABC 7 News.